and welcome to the spotlight on um, automating your peripheral detection. I know that's a really exciting title for a video, I couldn't think of anything better, but um, yeah, it's basically just a simple little step you can take to um, just automatically detect, say, what side your modem's on, or what side uh, a monitor or something is on. I'll show you now how that works. So, um, if we just run the test program here, you'll see the modem turns on. It was off a second ago. Just trust me. Um, and uh, to just show you how that works, basically what this does is it's just a for loop. Um, and it's just going to use the Redstone API to um, uh, just to get um, to basically check on each side of the computer. Uh, and if it's a, a peripheral, and um, so we're using, you're using the peripherals. Um, yeah, and if it's a modem, then we're just going to open the red net on that side and end the loop. It's that simple. Um, so I'll just do it again. Reboot. So you can see it in action. So now modem's off. Run test. Bam. And that could be on a side. So we'll switch sides and um, run test again. And bam, now that's on. Nice. Um, and this will also work for like monitors. So basically, oh good, it's already open. Um, so it's the same deal. Uh, basically, with you know getting the sides, uh, we're checking for our peripherals if there is one, um, and if it's a monitor, then we're going to um, just wrap the peripheral on that side B. Um, and then end it. And then we're just going to print found. So you can see that in action now. If we run test, bam, found, printed found. Um, and again, we can just run that again and it'll be on that side. Ta da! So yeah, that's uh, just something really simple. I mean, you probably won't use this if it's a program that you're, um, you know, if you're running around placing a bunch of computers with monitors attached to them, handy to have. Same deal again for, um, for your RedNet. Uh, so, you, you know, don't have to keep going through and uh, updating scripts and changing the sides of things. It's uh, it's very handy. Uh, cool. So, um, check the paste bin. Uh, sorry, check, check the comments for links to the paste bins on how to do these. Um, and, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. If you have any questions, let me know. I'll catch you next time.